84. Why isn't the video showing up? Let me check. There it is. Can I hear myself? Let's check the sound. Oh, I sound sensational. We are back here at IGV HQ. I'm here with Jankosaurus. Oh, Jank's a bit flat there. We've got a very special guest in the house today. Many will know him from circa late 90s nightclub scene in Melbourne. The one and only, the party man. Say hello to the fans, party man. Hey, guys. All right, we've got three boxes plus 10 starter packs. We all know what we're going to do first. We're going to do the starter packs, Jensasaurus, start ripping them off. For people that are new to our breaks, they will notice on transparency cam, everything stays on camera the whole time. So even as Jenks is opening those packets, you can always see what is going on. We're going to get started. Here we go, guys. There were no trades. I'll just double check there's no low trades. Ah, oh, BJ! G'day, Bejasaurus. Good to see you on board here on a Just Friday a night. G'day, Beach. Yes, yes, BJ, you're a funny guy. I see you landed the Maggies, did you? Yeah, BJ got the parts. I think he had like three spots here in the end. Well done, Beach. Two or three spots. All right, well, let's get into it. All right, let's do it. Hey, it's Don from Bam Breaks, the one and only. Well, I, I like how you did that just there. I uh, like good. it as well. Dougal Howard, we're going to start off with. G'day, Sean. G'day, Andy. Oh, Mitch. Carter. Mitch is on board as well. Hello, Mitch. All right. Jenks is making a help. How can I open packs? Come on. Hey, remember that. It's not, you know, I don't think this is your first time. Move them over. All right. Hope you guys are having a good Friday night. Let's see if we can pull some hits from the starter pack. Start some hair. All right. Oh, peace. The Buchanan. The Coonhounds. Pete Buchanan. Callum Brown and Todd Goldstein. We've got a burst here. Tom and Jonas. It's a party man you can see on the screen. I'll we'll show the cards as we open them. Well, we've got a first timer in the studio with us tonight. Yeah. Andy, how are you, mate? Oh, Luke Parker who's hiding there behind the pack. Sherwin's on board. Sherwin, is he on board as well? Excellent. Oh, the numbers are starting to flow in here now at RGV Breaks on a Friday night. Tom Williamson and Trent Dumont. So what we do is we uh, come on port and come on... <laughs> well, Don, you got to cheer for what you have. That's the luck of the draw. You know that better than anyone, Mitch Duncan. If you guys haven't checked out Bam Breaks, go and check out Don. He's got a fantastic community up there. He's one of the great breakers in the industry. Cheering for Port Adelaide and Gold Coast tonight. James H and Caleb Sarong. Rising star winner last year. So the party man, he's joined our stream for us tonight. Popped in and just thought he'd come and say hello down at RGB Collectibles. 13 Nelson Street, Moravid. Don, you'd be pretty happy if you hit uh, a wild card there. Absolutely. That's exactly what you want. Darcy Gardner. Oh, win card. There you go, Party Man. Give that to the kids. <laughs> party Man doesn't have kids. who just use it as some sort of tempting aid. Todd Marshall and Carl Heyman. The kids were very excited tonight, Party Man, when I told them I was going to see you tonight. <laughs> and they we want to see Uncle Party Man. Jamie Cripps and another win card for the Party Man. Loves the win cards. Hope you guys have had a good night. Lockie Henderson and Dom Sheet. Lost it. Wouldn't know it for sure. Port Coleman, a big chair. Absolutely, the Port Coleman is the one you want. Brent, oh, we've got a predictor! I reckon the first one. Who's the premiership predictor going to go to? Going to go to me. Oh, no, not Mitch. It's Dom. It's Don, it's the Gold Coast Suns! It's the Gold Coast Suns Premiership Predictor! Wow, we are off to the races. Let's have a look at the number. What number is it? Ooh, so close, 67. I think that's the number of members they have. Don, you are in the game. Congratulations to you, sir. First case hit of the night. Probably won't win, but nonetheless, 
nonetheless, you're on the board. But the good thing is everyone knows these cards go in trends. So if you've seen a Gold Coast predictor, so that could mean... Of, the start of that though, so. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah. G'day, Jonathan. How are you, mate? Johnny Lou. Johnny Lou on the stream as well. We've got 67 Matterau DPS. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, perfect. He's, he's PC card that is then, Don. Priceless. Don, are you in the GC or are you in Brisbane? I feel like you need to be a bit more patriotic to the mighty Gold Coast Suns. Tim English. I know uh, BG he's up in the Gold Coast. Just bought himself a lovely $12 million beachfront house. Yeah. It's a nice yacht. Now we get to go. He's going to park his yacht out the front. Yeah, very nice. Thanks, Jonathan. Always love having you on board. Joseph Castagna and Tom Scully, who is now retired. Always fun here at RGB Breaks, especially late night breaks. It's where AJ2 and myself absolutely dominate. Chase Jones, you're in Brisbane, mate. Oh, yeah. Oh, you do manage to throw in Gold Coast. All right. So you're sort of dollar each way on Brisbane and Gold Coast. Travis Collier and Lewis Jetta. What type of store do you manage, Tom? What is it? He's in the telecommunications industry. Oh, right. Yeah. Oh, you caught up with Beach for a beer. Wow. At the $12 million mansion? Or? Yeah. When I Beach had a bit of a laugh about his yacht. Get a helipad at your place, Beach. I, I visualise some sort of landing pad on either your yacht or your property. White ponies running around, all that sort of stuff. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's Friday night. I'm gonna have a bit of fun. Then we'll jet up. All my dolls go to the bombers. Yes, we know you're a big bombers fan. Shy Bolton and Bailey Williams. Come here, the star patches. Ah, Oh, Mitch McGovern. Big cards hide under these packs. Oh, I'd like one more hit from the starter packs, James. One more hit, please. So a few starters there. Still Matt DeBoer and Tom Kiki. Not sure if he's going to get a game this year. I think it's a tip, Don. The only Gold Coast card that's come out so far is the hit. Yeah. It's the only one that's empty in the James world. Cousins and Tom Jonas. So we're real time sorting as we go. So this saves us having to sort everything out. Travis Collier and later on. And Crozier. So this tray after the break just goes Just down the on the table after that. With a bunch of you made a house. Around. Well, BJ, honestly, with the amount of cards you win, that would not surprise me if you have a full Pendles display board. Reese Conker and Todd Goldstein. Have you worked out whether or not you're going to have a dedicated room in the house for the cards, BJ? Have you? Uh, Past that. Dedicated wing in the house. For dedicated the wing, yeah. Have you, have you got Mrs. BJ to approve that yet? Are you going for two or three Blakey acres for the car? Probably two acres. Two for the car. Absolutely. Look around. All right, we're down the last four packs of starter packs. I need a bang. I need a party man to see what a bang is. Brandon Ellis. Welcome everyone that's joining the stream. I see the numbers ramming up, which is great. Oh, we got a bang! Jay Lockhart, we all know what that means. Bang! Rory Sloan for the Adelaide Crows. That's going to you, Mitch. Let's see what we can do number-wise. Whoa! 44! Not his jumper number, but nonetheless... That is a good hit for you, Mitch. Welcome to the party. I'm going to come around and break a few boxes, party man. Pool table. Pool table? What? Oh, I remember. I love it, Beach. I like it. Uh, Glenn, the shop is definitely open tomorrow. We're still working out whether we're going to open so, Sunday. So, Beach, are you thinking that the heli pad goes on top of the rumpus ring or a bit too loud? <laughs> That'd be too loud. Uh, maybe to, a, uh, to the side of the pool deck. Yeah. Good. 150 metre pool deck. But, Glenny, yes, the shop is open tomorrow, 10 to 3. But obviously, if you come other hours, just ring the bell. We'll be here. Um, and on Sunday, well, we'll put a post on social media whether we're going to open on Sunday. But it's been a it's been a fairly long couple of weeks, so we might have a little bit of respite on Sunday, but we will see. All right, they are our starter packs. We pulled two hits out of it. Gold Coast Sun Predictor and also the Rory Slow Bank. 
Let's get stuck into the boxes. I know you're you're eager, aren't you, party man? You want to see what's in the boxes? All right. Thirty-six packs, empty box. Let's go. Beach, I think uh, our good friend Luke France is up in the Gold Coast, isn't he, at the moment? Have you caught up with him? Darcy McPherson, Mitch Robinson. I think he's spending a bit of time. Uh, we're always here for a laugh, Beach. Yeah, I heard he's up uh, up north at the moment, joining a little bit of R&R. &R. Tom Scully and Liam Duggan. James replying to messages from the fans. That's why I was a little bit slow on sleeping. Brett Bewley and Zach Jones. Uh, we always have a laugh here, Paige, but we are looking forward to coming up and seeing you, Kelly Pad. Yeah. Just or if you want to send down the jet, I'm not sure if you're putting a runway into the new place or the old house. I uh, think Gold Coast is not that big, so send the limo from the airport. Oh, oh no, it's Tom McDonald. Oh, I thought it was going to be another bang nice and early. Chris Main. Oh, I thought that was going to be it as well. Sam Reed. Brad Shepard and Jared Geary. Aaron Hayden and Liam Shields. Party man, you're looking forward to the footy season today. Can't wait. Can't wait being a D supporter. McDonald, Anthony McDonald, Dippin' Woody, and Ben King. Mitch McGovern and Jared Lyons. It is funny watching these on mute. Some of the some of the comments, the auto captions are very amusing. Brandon Archie and Cam Rayner, who unfortunately just did his knee. So he's probably going to be up for you. Hunter Clark, Jenks' love child, and May Rao. Yeah, I'm glad I've got that new one wild card now. Oh, you got that? In yeah. Greenwood. Which is the hunter and like Callum Wilkie. Comes through as a big strength. Nice. Party man, no time of yawning, you're doing next break. <laughs> Simo O'Brien, Jeremy McGovern, start limbering up the fingers, mate. Have a bit of humour ready as well, party man. I'll be sitting there quiet. Hayden Young and Todd Goldstein. Hey, Zach, sorry I didn't reply back to you earlier, Zach. We've just been uh, flat stiff here. Oh, is Zach on the... Back on the thread as well. Zachy Mates, he actually offered to come down and hang out and sleep and stuff tonight, but oh. did not get a chance to reply. Maybe it's tied up tonight. Yeah, I think it's tied up tonight between breaks and stuff. Yep. There's never any admin here when Dan and RGB collectibles. Someone's just sent me a message. I can't see that whoever's message me. Then I'll send an autograph out later. Mark O'Connor, <laughs> Levi Casablanca. <laughs> But yes, we will be open tomorrow, Glenny, if you want to come down. 10 to 3. Oh, Bailey French means up, bang! And it's Rory Love. He's done his knee as well, so we're probably not going to see much of him this year. But that's a hit for Fremantle. Oh, it's for our good man. Van Sanderson. Van Sanderson has been petty cars. 169. Van's come down to the shop a few times. So, Van, you'll be able to pick that one up when you next pop in. Another bang to add to the hit parade here at RGB Breaks on a Friday night. Darcy Moore and another win card for the party, man. Uh, did you just toppy Bailey Fridge? <laughs> oh, Jax, that is lovely. Picked up the wrong card. Wrong card to sleep. I, look, I understand the respect of Bailey Fridge, but <laughs> unfortunately, it's not the one we want to top load. We don't get this tomorrow from Perth. Oh, no, no, no. Glenn, it's tomorrow. No, Come on, Glenn. Come on, Glenn. Catch the red eye. You can yeah. still get the red eye tonight. No uh, like 11 o'clock. 
Oh, three hours yeah. behind. They're three hours behind. Oh, yeah, you can definitely get yeah, around. Go to the Red Eye and get in at 5am. Do yeah. it. And then if you fly up from Perth, you can come any time you want. Like, yeah. We might even send a driver to the airport. Absolutely. Like Trent McKenzie. Get on the Red Eye. Stephen Cornelio. AJ's got lots of points. In fact, he's saying he'll get you a Red Eye flight tonight. Absolutely. Only at the front of that Bailey Dale. Brian Myers. It's like a party man. He only flies private or at the front. <laughs> oh, here we go. So late, no, late night break has always involved some this is actually good. Episodes. I can't remember who it was. We were on tour. I was on tour. I can't remember who the artist was, whatever. And um, it's actually an Australian artist. And so uh, you do remember the artist? Yeah, it was. It was definitely an Australian artist. I can't remember who exactly it was. Right. But um, sitting up the front and everything, and had an, had an issue using the function of the seat. Right. Had a seat function issue and called the flight attendant over. And it was, you know, not not dressed in a fucking suit or anything like that. So it looked like a just artist. Like, it looked like an artist, yeah. Yep. yep. And the flight attendant comes over and literally goes, "Oh, must be the first time you've flown business class." <laughs> Person turns around and goes, "No, it's the first time I haven't, I haven't flown private." <laughs> Dude, that was the fucking story. It was so good. We should just like sit there, just mouth open. Yeah. Hope you come back. Yeah. I think it's uh, and we'll be there in a few weeks. Get the geo to the car right here. We will, Dan. How are you going, Dan? Don't worry, we've got a stash of Cook Millers for you we too. We do have some Cook Millers. We've got a couple of media. James the Robot. Dan Farr, president of the Tooth Miller Fan Club. Took the Took the Took Nation. Yep. Ben Patton and Josh Kennedy. It's one of the games of uh, Josh Kennedy this year. So, Party Man, are you ready? Next box, you. Come on. The fans want to see your work. I've heard about your fingers. <laughs> they want to make like it all through. Absolutely. Oh, I could tell some stories about the party, man. Wow, we thought you might have to wait to the after midnight show for that one. Not really PG related. Yeah, we'll keep the tooks for you. Don't worry, Dan. All right. Oh, we've got a double hit box. We've got a. Brown low metal predictor. Everyone knows Tom Green meets a brown low. We'll go from the bottom. All right, let's go. Oh, let me get some camera zoom. Here we go. All right, who is it? It's looking like a brown background. Who is it? Oh, it's not. Oh, is that Secuda? No, it's Essendon. Oh, it's Dylan Shield. That's, that's a that's ripper. A, that's a ripper. Absolute ripper there. Who's got Essendon? Andrew Stars. Well done to you, Andrew. A little look at the number. Nice 97. One That's a ripper. Unbelievable. Excellent. Probably the best S in the card in the whole series. Yeah. Like literally. Oh, the Ridley Market is probably pretty Oh, yeah, the Ridley Market. Yeah. Aside from the Ridley Market. Oh, Don's upset. Don oh, is Don. real flat. Oh, Dan, your cards came today. Fantastic. It All sounds like everyone's cards are being Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, no, from us. Yeah, I'm saying like yeah. the break mail is starting to come, which is good. Good to hear. We've got a big allotment of break mail to sort tomorrow from the last four breaks. Ah, uh, that's what, actually the party man's going to do that. Oh, perfect. Yeah. No, I think that was a yeah. reason why going to come, yeah. All right, we are all finished. Trade Gold Coast Perfect. We've got like infant heads up. It's like a cough. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing like it. There's no such thing as a free bottle of water here, party man. You've already done work. Turned up after a water, we said no, so we went back to the server. Yeah. 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 I'm sure you know there's unlimited Coke Zero here, buddy, man. What? Of course. <laughs> All right, box two. Oh, McGrath Shield, yeah, of course. But still, I do I do feel like a little bit of Don breaks inside every time an SM card comes out. Yeah. Hayden and Jaeger O'Meara. Darcy McPherson and Jarman Hippie. Party Man, I've been thinking a lot about our trip to Hong Kong, yeah. where we ate the best Peking duck in the world. Spring deer. Spring deer. Yeah. Yes. That's, that's the best. The best Peking duck restaurant in the world, some would say, or we certainly would. Tom Scully and Bradley Hill. Oh, I need a little bit of a beverage. Where is that? Hmm. If only Shield could keep stroke. Yeah. Oh, beautiful, Peter. Not the only ones he doesn't have. Oh, please, they all arrive. Good, Peter. Thank you. 
ravioli. Oh, yeah. That's the real the real time penny slaving that's taking place. Yep. Right? Every single card that you get sent gets penny sleeved at RGB. Penny sleeved with love. Yeah, with love. Yeah. With love, love and care. And, and, every, and, and some emotion. Would you believe every envelope that leaves RGB HQ? Jenks personally kisses. As, yeah. oppo as opposed to Carlton cards when they come out in breaks, I certainly don't kiss them. <laughs> Have we put no? We have not pulled a DR cross marker yet. I actually haven't seen one in the flesh. I would never leave bodily fluids from my lips on your cards, Dave Stress. Oh, that's not too far. <laughs> Anthony McDonald, Tip and Woody, <laughs> and Jack Petrocelli. Have you seen one yet, Beach? The ACOS marquee. Hope you guys all heard on Card of Three the other night that Select like, are going to replace the DR crosses. And Dr. Goldstein. All right, we've still got Bane to come here. Hugh Greenwood and Zach Butters. I feel like Zach Butters' profile in this release. It's just blown up his profile. Uh, it's like the bloke is basically Matt Rauch. Tim, oh, Tim O'Brien, I thought that was something else, saying Cordy. I haven't put a, Dia uh, a Diagos, or a Dacos, and I haven't put a Shy Bolton yet. Or a Caulfield. I haven't seen many Caulfields in there before. No. Nah. And I saw me in the WA stuff, like usual. Yeah. All the good Saints cards always end up in WA. Oh, I thought that was something else, but no, it's just Lucky Neil. I made a trade. Diagos Marquee. Oh, oh, that's right, for a Bolton. Is it for a Bolton, Zach? Did you do that here in the office, actually? I think you did. Yeah, RGV is a meeting point for everyone. Absolutely. Yeah, I do remember that when uh, Jimmy, Jimmy yeah. popped in. Yeah, Jimmy popped in. Honestly, the last couple of weeks has been a, a blur. Uh, one break I was in, forgot where I'd put them. Oh, okay. <laughs> I mean, it's a bit like that as well. I swear I haven't watched any of the breaks. I've really watched watch any breaks. I've been at least like $800, $1,000 at the breaks and uh, have not seen the more than that. I feel like yeah, a heap of mail is going to arrive this way. And I'm going to be like. Well, I had a package from Fast Break on today, but I haven't been up to that yet. Oh, yeah. Got some heat. Oh, baby, fridge means a bang! We got another case here, or box it, should I say. Oh, it looks black here. It looks black. Do you reckon it's dusty? Because uh, that would have been yellow. Flies. Let's see what it is. No, I reckon it's Carlton. Oh, it is Carlton. Sam Doherty. Who has the mighty blows? Oh my god. We all know who it is. It's Flam Dunk Time. Iron Flam with the Dockety. Number 112. It's not a break if there isn't a hit for the Flam Meister. I think he's off playing poker tonight with a couple of friends of mine. Hope you guys are having a good night. No doubt watching the show from there. Maybe on YouTube. Flam would be there with two iPads, two phones. Absolutely. Well, sitting on the table. Yeah. That's what he does. Just giving money away. Yeah, he, he loves that fish he is. Fish he is. So we haven't actually talked about Flam's focus skills for a few weeks. So that's a great subject. It's not a <laughs> Basically, if you ever have the opportunity to play poker with Orion Flam, the Flam Dunker, yep. you should take up that opportunity. But do know he is the ultimate fish. I've got hundreds of hollow coils coming from the Flam shot. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, Flam shot. <laughs> I like that. He's such a fish that, more. as I have described it before, if you put him in the freezer, he would become a packet of fish fingers. <laughs> flam fingers. Yeah, flam, the flam bird's eye fish finger collaboration. Yep, I like that. Uh, I reckon such, such a fish, and one of the fish that gets lucky all the time. We do love flam, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> flam shot. We should get that trending. Yeah. We should try and get that trending done. We just all need to say it's on. That's the thing. So I'm, I'd like you to write uh, 32 bars, but you have to mention flam at least eight times in 32. Yes. All right, Don. There's a challenge for you. Imagine, imagine if you guys... We, we, we could all use it as the break soundtrack. Oh, the international anthem the of breaks. The international anthem of breaks called Flam Shunt. Oh, I love it. He would hate it. It would be the greatest. And we could call the album Flam Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. How good is this late night, Friday night? Oh, ooh, amen. You want to pick that one up? 
Well, it probably is you need some empty packets. We don't know where to find it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We have so much rubbish here that it gets picked up on an all-weather forklift. Actually, it literally does. We completely underestimated the amount of sleeves we use and the rubbish. We need to get a full-size skip kit coming along. Really? And the forklift comes and picks it up. Yeah. It was right. actually obscene. Like seriously, like. <laughs> uh, I won't be tough. You, Don, you're very good at what you do. Don, you're an absolute wordsmith. Yeah. Get it done. You've got thirty minutes. Yeah. 30 minutes. <laughs> Don, you could come record it here in the RGB studio on our nano microphones. Absolutely. Good park. Uh, all right, we're down to about seven packets in the second box. And then the party man's going to jump in the braking seat. He's going to drive this one home. Come on, party man. Uh, I wouldn't know who to do. That's all right, we'll work you through it. Tom Green and the win. Oh, Georgia. So, James, I was thinking, and we'll give these guys a little bit of a preview tonight. I think we should start doing some pick your own teams tomorrow. Uh, open to this way of thinking. And uh, maybe, and I haven't even told you about this, but what about if we did pick your own team doubles? Yeah. So, like, we paired up two teams together Gold Coast and, say, Collingwood. Ah, like it. And like Richmond it. and, say, like Adelaide. And that maybe yeah. reduces the price for both of them. Okay. But that way, people just get to get the teams they want plus a little bit of extra cheddar. I like that. It's not a bad idea, is it? Yeah. Have a good run out tomorrow. Yeah. All right. That is a great idea. That's what I'm here for. Not only my good looks and humor, but also a great idea. All right, last pack. Oh, no, nothing. All right, we are on to our third and final box. Party there. Your turn? Um, okay. All right. Oh, Kano has just joined the stream from Box Break TV. Oh, the Box Break TV man himself. He's been stepped out of the TV into the stream. He's been killing it, Kano. Welcome to the party. Friday night breaks. Like the new kid on the block. Yes. I've jumped in a few of Kane's breaks. One way to get rid of GWS and pick a 10, yes? Yeah. And you know what? Even though AJ has just come up with it right now, we're happy for anyone who wants to pursue that concept. Yep. They don't even need to claim on their own live stream that they've stolen it off someone in fact. Who would do that? I don't know. I don't know who would do that. Yeah, Dan, we might run with that tomorrow. Like, honestly, it just came to me and it's, it's seriously genius. But Dan, we'll attribute it to you. Okay, you know, I hope you had a good night. I hope you guys have done some good breaks over there at Box Break TV. Another well, a newcomer to the industry, but has really built a really nice community. So you either join the big hitters, he says. Where are they? Yeah, there's certainly none here. Well, I mean, Party Man's here. Party Man is here. <laughs> Callum Wilkie and Nat Five. His theme song is, if anyone remembers, the thing that busts his gun. Oh, everyone knows Tom Liberatore. What's behind the Tom Liberatore? It's a lightning. Oh, it's Maxi King. I reckon it's number one. Could it be number one? No, I see. <laughs> you don't know. Uh, young Jenks here. He uh, collects security cards. He's got a couple of them. And uh, he really likes low numbers. So I'm not going to cover it so he can't see it. Always a jack still. And we're going to do it on camera. And we're all going to walk it together. I even have to look on the camera because I can't see that. Oh, so. oh, 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 please be low. Please be low. Please be low! Oh, it is low! I need it. Zero <laughs> seven. Who's got the sights? Who's got St Kilda? Timmy Upton. Oh, Timmy Upton, PM sent. Oh, please. Timmy, I got a fear that there could be some lost mail. I fear there might be lost mail. Can't believe I called a low. Unbelievable. But I want to wow. see this way, too. If you decide to move that card, I really wow. I would really like to purchase or trade it. <laughs> uh, very much so. Open your DMs it's up. Ripper. It's a ripper. Yep. Maxi King, it's a very good one. Wow, Jax, he's up and about now. The low number king. Yeah. Jeez. Hold it hostage, yeah. Oh. It might be held hostage. PM sent, that's right, Pete. There's going to be a lot of PM sent. Jax loves his low number. So, low number is between one and nine. And obviously, one is awesome, but anything single digits is huge. 
That's not making its way out of your nah, so This is just like a, a mirage. It's like <laughs> what live stream? What live stream? <laughs> <laughs> we actually did have a power outage before. Yeah. So someone was trying to mess with us and take out our security system, but the UPS kicked in. They got scared and they did the runner. And the party man came out with his big stick. They were gone very quickly. No one messes with the party. When they realised they could not the take out the power here. They've gone. Yeah. Gone in an instant. That's what happens. Keep the fans at bay. <laughs> yeah, Tyrone, yeah, I think Tyrone's already PM sent that. Everyone's PM sending it. Justin Bloom will have messaged already. Absolutely. He'll be happy because I'm sure he's watching the break as well. He would be, of course. Everyone's watching. It's like 1,300 viewers. <laughs> Sam Gray and Nick Haynes. I mean, 13. <laughs> Sorry. Same stuff. Oh, Jenks is on his phone. He's. Quickly sending a quick PM. G'day, Tim, how you going? Not sure if you're awake, but uh, you got like a Max King 007. Who do you support, mate? Maybe, I, just, <laughs> maybe, maybe I can swap your card, oh, right? I see a heap of PM sent comments. That means only one thing low numbered or jumper numbered states. That's right, Strongy. Yeah. That's exactly what has just come oh. out. Scrimshaw and David Swallow. It's like, G'day, Tim. Yeah, look, sorry to trouble you again. I know it's my third message, but. Hey, I really want that Max King 007. Uh, can I uh, trade you, like, I don't know, anything you want? Um, Matt Tabernard, Cab Strong. Sleeving takes a back seat for a few minutes. Yeah. Well, you we can, so. Pretty fast. 007 Bond King, yeah. Oh, yeah, it is 007, of course. How did I miss that? Tyrone, bang. That is some that's sharp work from you. That's the James Bond Max King. All right, we're still waiting for another. Uh, yeah, we've still got another bang coming. Maybe even a third hit. Um, he's definitely working hard to get the card already up. See, he's got his credit card in his hand. <laughs> so he's either ordering Uber Eats or he's trying to load his PayPal up. Either way. Yeah, oh, 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 Jack Henry. And Elliot, yo! Oh, absolutely. Like, the amount of times I see Jenks get tagged in things, it's insane. <laughs> so you come around here often? <laughs> Jordan Ruffhead and Christian Petrarca. Yeah, absolutely. He's been tagged at about 8 million three hundred forty. Oh! I think this is a big one! I think we've got a big one. There could be some PM sent here. Everyone get ready. Really? I think it's going to be a Tigers. Is it Dusty? I think it's a Tigers. I'm not for any more check. Oh, it's Hawthorne! It's Hawthorne and Flame Shields! Who's got the Hawks? Oh, we know who's got the Hawks. Who's got the Hawks? Bam! Dunk again! Another one for the flam! Let's have a little look-see. Can we get another low number? Oren Flam, he loves a low number. He loves to PC low numbers. Easy to flip for him. All right, what number is it? What number is it? What number is it? Oh, it's 114, not low enough. Well done, Flam Dunk. Yeah, Jen... Adam Jenke is a new member of the page. Yeah. All right. I, re I don't even reckon Tim Upton's watching, but Tim, if you are watching, I haven't even messaged you. I feel bad if I did that. No pressure. Don't stress. If you want to get rid of the fucking card, you know who's talking <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Great hit there, Tim. If you do ever decide that you want to move it on, feel free to let me know. I would be happy to engage in that form of conversation with you. So, so that's code for as soon as I can stop breaking, it's like, hey, do you reckon you can send Tim, Tim a message for me? <laughs> Darcy Fogarty, Rory Sloan. Maybe he says, I'd love another predictor. I'd yeah. just like one more predictor to finish the night off. Or are we doing another break? Oh, what are you doing to make Just touching my card. I'm not <laughs> touching my card. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, we want uh, we want fun to do some new things tomorrow. It's all fun and games over here. That's what we do at RGV. We're all midnight break. Midnight break. 
I mean, the, I can see the player man is itchy. He wants to do it. Yeah. He just wants to whack a case over. Yeah. He may only break his cases. Yeah, that's how we, uh, Start the cases. That's how he rolls. He only does two hour sessions. When P Man buys packets from the servo, he rolls his Rolls Royce up, his driver runs in, grabs in pretty much whatever's there. And it's incredible. If he takes 10 packets, he gets 10 predictors. Yep. Exactly. All from a fresh box. It's kind of like Kim Jong Il. Some of the stories about the Party Man. He's the greatest in every sport yep. in existence. Yep. And he's had the most sexual partners of anyone ever Absolutely. in history. What do you think about that? Generally, he's got more than one box in the morning. Absolutely, there's no. I think Tim Octon might have a few messages sent from McCarthy and Hugh Greenwood. I mean, there's not many secure supporters out there. Not collected. Where did all these people come from? Created them. He used to be. He used to just be me. Jack Kelly, Chris May. And then you get Strongy and Aaron. Yeah. Ping. Where's Ping been actually? Now that I think about it. A bit of TV time last year, and he's very quiet. Why? Very, very quiet. That's why I've got the fans floating around in the Saints group. Yeah. Bailey Williams and Caleb Daniel. We're down to four packets. We're running out of time for another predictor. Even though this has been an exceptional three box break. Exceptional. Jared Berry, and there's Pimant's final win card for the night, I'd say. Lots of low number collectors for the Saints, even non Saints collectors collect any fans. Will Centerfield. All right, second last pack. Come on, come on, predictor. Lucky I stocked up on low numbers when the Saints weren't popular. Hey, Strongy. Luke Dalhouse. And here's. I might need to pull out some of the old low numbers to get some of the new low numbers. Come on, let's, uh, let's, just, let's just work the, the predictor at the top. All right, last pack. Everyone hold your breath. Oh, 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 no. Phil Davis and Toby Green. All right, gents and ladies, that has been an amazing night. We've got three bangs, Gold Coast Predictor, Shield Premiership Predictor, and, of course, the James Bond PM Cent Max King 007 Lightning. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Another fantastic week here at RGB Collectibles. We will have, or well, RGB Breaks, RGB Collectibles will be open tomorrow, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Coming down and see Broad, Jenks, myself. He man might still be here sorting mail. Come down, grab a box, do some trades, do whatever you need to do. It's always great to catch you down here at RGB. Have a good evening. Thank you, gents. Good tomorrow. Good